here. I'm gonna do a quick bug out bag video here. Got everything laid out. Um, this isn't everything I would bring. Over here I got stuff that can normally be found in my truck or on my person. So I'm not gonna really address guns or anything in this video. Just show you what's in my bag. This is the bag that sits by the door. Weighs just over 30 pounds now. It's constantly evolving. I've learned a lot from you guys in the group over the last month or two since I've joined. So let me go through everything here. Left to right. Okay, we got these things that everybody loves. I got mine stuffed with oatmeal. I haven't put the key ring on there yet. Um, these are some quick snacks. I got these. And yeah, I got a lot of food in here. More than you might see in other people's bags. Because I'm bugging out with three other people. I got two kids. So yeah, I got sweet and sour pork, rice and chicken, fettuccine alfredo. I don't like to buy the same. You know, variety is good, so you don't get tired of anything. I got one of these cook kits. It's stuffed with rice. Another canteen there. This has snare wire, fishing stuff, spices, and stuff like that. Really compact kitchen kit. These are nice. They go together and fit in this little pouch here. Keep my life straw and my mini Sawyer wrapped in these little ShamWows. Good to have a ShamWow with you. This is my actual bag. This is first aid. I got bungees on it. Real nice way to organize everything in this bag. Big carabiner. Um, this is really my go-to survival knife. It's an old Schrade. Really sturdy, full tang. Keep a sharpening stone in here and a fire starter in here. Uh, other side, I just got a canteen. In my pocket, I have one of these water keys. I suggest everybody keep one of those. Really good, especially for urban bug out. On my straps here, I like to have a few things easily accessible so I don't have to drop my pack and get into it. So I just a cheap little camelus knife on a strap here. Really handy. Compass. Little Gerber multi-tool. Can unclip real quick. Just a little cheap light. That's basically the bag. Tape up your ends. A couple handkerchiefs. I just put those in there after post I read the other day. Mosquito head net. <coughs> Excuse me. This is a mini duffel bag that clips onto the outside. Some things I have on the outside, one, this is one of them. Just so I can grab it and load up any other loot I might find along the way, canned goods, whatever. This is a REI, just something to warm my head if it gets cold. Some cordage, some good rope, some good work gloves, warm gloves, paracord. Those would be socks, and this is a sleeping bag. A tarp that I don't like. I want to get a better one. Stakes, per Dave Canterbury's advice. Batteries for my two-way radio and my light. Four Bix magnifying glass wrapped in toilet paper. A neat little multi-tool thing. Let's see if I can do this with one hand. It's got a light, magnifying glass, signal mirror, compass, thermometer, whistle. Yeah, great multi-purpose thing. Sewing kit, a lot of thread, curved needles, big needles. Zip ties, you never know when you'll need those. Very useful. Another knife. This is a piece of waxed Brazilian rosewood. I can think of quite a few uses for that. Uh, Allen wrenches, multi-tool. I need a better multi-tool. That one sucks. Yeah, you already saw that. Contractor bags. Two of them. Thick ones. Tape, Gorilla, electrical. Electrical tape is really good because these buckles here can break and snap and you can use the electrical tape to repair those and hold them together temporarily. 
uh, lockpick signal mirror drill bit wrapped in signal ribbon. Pretty good idea that I saw somebody else have incorporated it into my pack. This compass and binoculars, they go in this, and this also hangs on the outside. Little fire kit I made. Some of you might have seen that in another post. There's matches, alcohol swab, cotton, just some shit in there. Aluminum foil, pulley can be very useful. Survival bracelet with a watch, compass that's probably shit, and whistle, fire starter, and there's a bunch of fishing gear in there. A couple tools, can opener, you know. Survival wrap, poncho, poncho, saw. Yeah, you can't do that one handed. But yeah, you might have seen that in another post too. Toilet paper, char cloth, Fritos. Emergency blanket, flask. Now we're getting into the first aid stuff that goes on the first aid kit on the outside. Good thing to have in your pack. Another flashlight. Flask. My first aid kit sucks. I really need some tourniquets and clotting agents. So yeah, that's something I really need to work on. In here, it's just a waterproof map case, waterproof matches, survival playing cards, emergency flare, pen, pencil, sharpie, bottle rockets, a couple notebooks, mountaineering medicine book, Oregon map. I believe that's it. Oh, and I got this camo thing there. Yeah, but if I have to bug out, I'm taking all this, and I'm probably going to have another bag, my guns, the kids are going to have their bags, the wife's going to have her bag, so yeah, you get the idea, thanks for watching.